Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Rail back with another motherfucking reaction, man. How y'all feeling this evening, morning, early morning? Yeah, whatever, whatever, man. So I'm minding my business, right? Watching fucking Your Honor. Check out that shit. Uh, Snowpiercer. You know what I'm saying? Just enjoying my time scrolling through Twitter. And what did what the fuck did I come across? Did is so? Wait a minute. I see tweets talking about. 6 9 waiting for Meek Mill outside the club. I said, no. What? Why? Not on the eve of Valentine's Day or just not in general like that. What? 6 9 I ain't even heard from this nigga. Like, waiting for Meek Mill. Like, but how? Hey, let's watch it and find out, man. Fuck it. Let's get right into it. Because <laughs> I said, I got to bring this to y'all. <laughs> So we clearly six nine is the one holding the camera, barking at Meek Mill and his security. Well, I think Meek got on a nice little fedora. Check him out with his blues and his fedora. Look at that guy. Ooh, pastels. He says, "Shut up." <clears throat> That's a fact that nigga's pussy. I got my own God damn, that footage is like fucking Cloverfield, man. Remember that shit with the fucking shit shaking when the monsters pop out? Like, so they look like they're in a the parking garage. Don't know what fucking city this is. I'm guessing it's one or two fucking towns somewhere in Atlanta, somewhere in Texas. Them is the only places. <clears throat> that don't that said fuck covid we open and we kicking it so i'm assuming it's one of those two spots and uh the shaky footage is six nine yelling at him yelling at six yelling at meek mill about fucking security and how his security is police and look at him he's with a cop and i mean <clears throat> so so ain't i mean niggas with money should have should have security. I'm just not understanding. So why did all this go down? Let's. I, I did some further digging and found some other footage. I found something from the opposite perspective. Let's get into it. Who's next? Go, 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 go. Right. This is from the cam of Meek Mill. Let's see what the fuck happened on his end. Oh, he, he's come with captions. Thank you for letting us in. Huh? What y'all trying to give me lock, lock? What y'all weirdos trying to give me lock, lock? Clown ass nigga. Why the fuck y'all even bring that clown over here? Okay. Uh so Meek Mill says they just trying to go viral. He keeps screaming, which I want me to get locked up. Y'all yeah, trying to get me in trouble. I don't know. I mean that's fair, but it did say let's go check out one of these captions where I believe it said he fucking spit on them. Okay, why six nine just run up on me with a bunch of cops? So I spit on him. I thought I was dreaming. He waited outside the club for me with the something. It cut off right there. So just ran up on me with a bunch of cops. So I spit on him, and I would assume this is. So now it's they're they're arguing about who got the most cops. Um, yo, okay, for real. I just got <clears throat> I just got a few things. I got a few questions. One, when did fucking two grown men or two two men arguing turn into fucking this? Yeah, you bitch ass nigga. No, you a hoe ass nigga. Nigga, fuck the yeah, nigga, fuck what you talking about, nigga. I mean, nobody seen nothing wrong with the the phone arguing battle. Like nobody seen nothing wrong with this shit. Like yeah, fuck you, pussy, pussy ass nigga. Fuck you, I will kill you, nigga. You ain't no shit in chance, right ass nigga. Fuck you doing with scared. Like, come on, man. This is dead. what happened to just arguing without the fucking Cloverfield cameras and shit. Like, just 
And then tell us about it later. Like, everything got to be videotaped. And niggas wonder why they stay in court. Stay with bullshit. Because now, if they really want to, they could say, oh, you spit on him. That's like fucking assault during COVID. Uh, you already on probation. Meek Mill lock back up. Like, that's just dumb. It, it, niggas love telling, yo. I cannot. I don't know where you niggas came from, where y'all was born. But y'all love self-snitching. And then the second question, right? I'm like, of all the of all the reasons and the times, like, why would Six Nine choose Meek Mill to be the one he want to press, run up on, or wait for outside the club? Like, what gave him? What what did Six Nine see that made him go, yeah, I'm pressing this nigga. Hmm. I'm willing to bet everything that it was video of this nigga Meek Mill doing these bunny hops with these. Short shorts, the yellow socks, you got the nice pastels. Look, this nigga loves pastels. Because you got your ass beating tennis. You got your ass beat. Keep going. Count out loud. Count out loud. This looks like... You know what? That's fair. If I, if I see a nigga doing this, if I got beef with a nigga, and I see... and I, You know what I'm saying? If, if I got problem with the ops, and I see them on camera doing this, this is probably the best time to press him. That's probably the best time to press a nigga. Smiling with them. Look at this nigga, man. I don't know. But, yo. That was... That was fucking stupid. On both parts. Like, it's dumb. Nobody gives a shit. I just covered it. Just only because... I, I hate the self And the fucking battling with the phones. Like, they some fucking girls. Like... Man, come on, man. Y'all, now, nah, you know what would have been dope? If 6 9 really pressed you and put out his camera screaming and you just was like, ha, two fingers, like, you have a good one. If you just played it off cool, but you had to turn your phone on and you had to log in. Imagine arguing with a nigga. You like, hold on, let me get on live real quick. You got to put your code in. You got to put your face ID. You be like, yeah, pussy, just wait till I get my phone on. Shit, shit. All right, hold on. All right, yeah, now, nigga, record. Like, come on, man. <laughs> Niggas is silly. <laughs> Hell, oh, man, I, whatever, man. I'm out, man. It's late. These niggas is clowns, both of them. It's sad. But, yo, that was it, man. Uh, enjoy y'all Valentine's Day, man. If you're in Chicago, I'm sorry for you because it's cold as shit out here. So, I mean, hey, you can save a few bucks, nigga. Make that, make that, that uh, chicken Alfredo that you know how to make, nigga. Grab them asparagus. Put that motherfucker in there. Make a whole little meal for sure. Y'all don't even got to go out. Pretend to go out. You ain't even got to get Uber Eats. I'm talking about a 15-minute meal, and then y'all cuddle up under something. And, you know, watch me on YouTube. Watch my review of Your Honor and other fuck shit like this. Go crazy. And hit that subscribe and that like and comment and share. Do all that special shit for you, boy, man. Uh, Y'all be safe out there, man. Peace.